I greet you all in the wonderful name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, who is the only uncreated Son of the Father. We are journeying together on prayer, and our focus in the three previous videos has been on the Lord's Prayer. Now, as a reminder, we, we will find the longer version of the Lord's Prayer in Matthew chapter 6, verses 9 to 13, and the shorter version of it from Luke chapter 11, verses 2 to 4. Today, we are discussing the debt petition. On this video, we are discussing the debt petition of the seven petitions of the Lord's Prayer. Now, this petition, the third one, is where we say or we pray or we recite, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. I just have two short points to make on this video. The first point is this. <clears throat> just before we ask what we need, and we've been asking actually what we need all this time around, but just before we say, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven, we affirm that we want a world that is exactly the same as where the rule of God is abound. This petition is a cry, is a cry by us to God that the earth is not yet in the hands of the Russians, is not just, lacks justice. There is too much injustice on this earth that God should correct. That's what we are crying for here. Here on earth there's violence between human beings, there is inequality, there's corruption, and so on. We therefore plead with God here to say, please God, correct these things. The second short point that I want to make is that, which is connected to the first, is that your will be done on earth as it is in heaven is also about subjecting oneself to the rule of God. Where we say, when we say this petition, we are telling God or we are asking God that we are surrendering ourselves to his will. In this petition, we pray that everyone on earth surrenders themselves and joins the angels and the archangels and the saints in serving the king, in revering his holy name, in doing his will perfectly. Just as it is done in heaven, that's what we are saying on this petition. We are asking God that we want to save him, serve him blamelessly, just as the angels and the saints and the archangels are serving him. We are saying to God, we are unable to rule the world in a manner that is uh, in accordance with your will. Therefore, we are surrendering ourselves to God and the earth to God, the creator, in this surrendering, surrendering of ourselves, that we, it is in surrendering rather of ourselves that we see God's power revealed or at play. So when we say, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven, we are actually surrendering ourselves and the world to God and that everything should happen. We are saying to, to, to ourselves and to God, that actually we want this world, we want ourselves, we want this world to do your will as it is done in heaven, as it is done by the angels, as it is done by the saints and the archangels and every creature in heaven. Let us pray together the Lord's Prayer as taught to us boldly by Christ. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen. Thank you for watching. Please do watch the previous videos on this series and the following ones. Thank you. God bless.